Hey guys, we are on the Carnival Freedom and we are on a five night Caribbean cruise. And I just thought that I would share with you the daytime and the nighttime looks here on the cruise. So if you want to see the cruise looks for a five night Caribbean cruise, just keep watching. Today is travel day. We flew down the day before the cruise start. This is what I wore on the plane, which is a shirt that my friend that I'm traveling with made. Morning girls trip in progress. And then a pair of jeans there from Wenton Wisdom, nice comfortable waistband and then Skechers. That's what I always wear when we are on the plane and in the airport. So this is the travel day outfit and I will be back tomorrow. Okay, so this is day one, which is embarkation day and my friend and I have our matching shirts on that says cruising besties. And then I just have a pair of navy colored or royal blue color shorts on and then some croc flip-flops. This is the day wear when we were coming on board the ship and then we will be dressing for dinner shortly. So today is day one dinner outfits. And first off, I have this clutch. It's the lug huddle and it can actually be a clutch, a crossbody or a shoulder bag. So that is what I chose to do as a clutch today. And then I have this little floral dress, great big neck with ruffles. And then these shoes are these blush sandals you see these a lot guys i wear these all the time and i just thought this was a real cute look for dinner for day one and then the jewelry is this ring from timu apple watch and then this heart necklace and these earrings these silver hoop earrings from kendra scott so this is the whole outfit for day one dining so today is day two it is an at sea day and all we can do is just out and about doing some things throughout the ship. And so I have just this black button up, really nice, soft feeling at top. And these pull on shorts, they're a longer length short, but you can roll them up for a different look if you want to, dog or wash. Then I have these blush slides that I have been wearing as well, nice and comfortable for all day wearing around. Of course, I have my sunnies, my key sunglasses, and then Apple Watch and then this bracelet. Today they were doing a thing for a free bracelet and then you get the charms of the day. So I did pick that up. And then I've been wearing this today as well. So this is today's at sea outfit for today. And then tonight is elegant dining. So I will show you my dining attire for tonight as well. Today is day two and this is elegant evening night. So to dress up, I just have this dress has a little bit of a slit on it some really pretty lace up at the top and then it has this faux wrap detail and then i have this clutch that i'll be carrying this is also like a crossbody and a shoulder bag too but i'm gonna carry it as a clutch and then i have these shoes on they're a cute little sandal from walmart and they have this chunky heel and then the jewelry is just my apple watch and then a simple three-tone bracelet. It has gold, silver, and rose gold tones to it. So this is the complete elegant look for tonight for dinner. So today is day three and we are in Grand Turk. So we are going to be at port all day today. So I have my swimsuit on underneath this and I thought it's going to be a really nice hot day. So I wanted to dress for the hot weather and just be able to simply just take something off with my bathing suit on underneath it. So I just wanted to have something real easy to be able to take off when I went to the beach area. So we do have a tour schedule for the day to tour the island. And then after that, we'll be going to the beach area and I'll have my swimsuit there. So my swimsuit is actually on under this and I just have a pair of these pre to play Love these shorts, you guys. And then I also have this shirt that my friend got us matching shirts for the first day at port. I think she got these from Timu. The other two shirts that you saw on the travel day and on the embarkation day, she actually did make those. But then I do have these shoes. They are so comfortable. So I know we're gonna be doing some walking as we do the tour. So I wanted to make sure I had some good walking shoes, but yet still some that are waterproof. So these are really good. They are comfortable to wear, adjustable with a little Velcro, but they're completely waterproof. And if I get any sand on these as I'm walking on the beach, they're gonna be easy to wipe that sand off. So that's why I chose these because they do have a little bit of squishy cushioning in them, but they are completely waterproof and sandproof. You'll be able to slide those right off. So this is what I'm wearing. And then I will just go ahead and show you the swimsuit for today as well. 
So I brought four swimsuits total and it's only a five day cruise, but this is the one that I will be taking out to port. I think it's a really cute bathing suit and then that'll be my cover up is just that tank and the denim like shorts that I showed you earlier. This is day three and here is the dining room outfit. So I just have this dress, a casual dress, beautiful Caribbean colors and these casual sandals. And then the jewelry that I have is this wrap bracelet from Victoria Emerson, Apple Watch, and then I just have these gold hoops for a little casual look. So this is the dining option for day three. Today is day four and it is a sea day. So I just have this dress on to walk around the ship throughout the day. And then these shoes are some really great shoes that are completely waterproof and just very comfortable and squishy to wear throughout the day walking around the ship. So this is day four, which is a C day. So I wanted to just kind of hop on here and show you the cover up that I have for up on the pool deck for the at C day. I think this is so cute and comfortable. It has pockets. So if you want to just take this without having to worry about a beach bag up there, then you can just throw your key card and your phone in this and because it's got some really nice pockets to circle him, like a little rounded him. And then it has this drawstring on the back, which makes it adjustable and more flattering. It also has a hood if you want a hoodie on this, but it's made out of that terry cloth material. And I think it is so wonderful. So this is what I'll just be wearing up on the pool deck. But I did just want to also show you the beach bag that I take out to port and that I take up to the sun deck. This is from the Aloha company. It's really great because the material this is made out of is a splash proof. But I think these are really great. This is what I think they call the day tripper, but it's got some zipper compartments and stuff in it and just really neat. So this is my beach bag that I have been using throughout the trip. This is day four and for the dining room, I chose this dress. It's a Shein dress, so super affordable. And it's just in this really cute red with these puff sleeves. They have elastic on them. And then this v-neck that has this lace detail at the top does hit right above the knee. And then I just have these scoop sandals on that come from Walmart. And then I have the clutch that I wore the other day. I have it with the chain that comes with it. So it's kind of an over the shoulder as well. But this is the lug huddle in this metallic black color. And this is the outfit for the dining room for day four. A few of the nights have been a little bit cool, so I did bring this along for the days when we do the movies up at the pool deck at night. When the wind's blowing, it gets a little bit chilly, plus some of the theaters have been chilly at night. So after dinner, if we're doing any of the shows or the movies at the pool deck, then I just throw these on. These are some crop pants in a cotton material, really comfortable. And then this sweatshirt has some pockets in here so I can just throw my phone and the key card in there and not have to carry anything else and then my sketchers in this baby as well so this is kind of just the hanging out at night when it gets a little bit cooler this is what I've been putting on so today we were supposed to be in Bimini this is day five and we were told that it was too windy that we could not port so today ended up being a day at sea so out of the five days we were supposed to port in Grand Turk which we did and Bimini, which we did not get to today, but this was the outfit for today. I just have my croc flip-flops on, and then I just have one of these pull-on tank style dresses. They're from Time and True that you get from Walmart. So I had this on over my bathing suit. So I had to change because the door kept shutting and I could not show you in the mirror, but this is the plan for over the bathing suit. And let me just show you the bathing suit so you can see it. So here's the second bathing suit option for here on the cruise. And this one's from Amazon and really cute little almost two piece, but it's a one piece. So since we did not stop at Bimini and it was a day at sea, this was an option. These pre to play shorts from White House Bike Market. I think that's all the shorts that I brought on board about. These blush slides and this cute little top here with this lace detail on the sleeves. So these are kind of like in a dark baby color and then this blush pink top. So another option for a day at sea on the ship. So today is the last day in the dining room outfit for today is this jumpsuit. It is a strapless. It has this really nice smocking at the top with this ruffle detail. It's more of a crop style. And then these blush sandals that I've worn throughout the cruise as well. And because it gets a little bit cool in the dining room, I do have a denim jacket to put over it. So here's the look with the denim jacket. Really cute and stretchy jacket to wear over the jumpsuit for the cooler air-conditioned dining room, which today the temperature has been 
rather cool anyway, but here is the outfit for the dining room for the last night. All right, guys, so that is what I wore on this five night cruise to the Caribbean on the Carnival Freedom. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Also, I would love to have you consider hitting that subscribe button. I do weekly videos on fashion, beauty, and lifestyle, and I also do the travel vlogs when I'm traveling. So I hope to see you in my next video, and until then, I hope you have a wonderful day.